This is Scott the Fix-It Guy. Our goal with our videos is to empower you to be able to do the repairs on your own and save a whole lot of money and also get that great feeling of having fixed it by yourself. Today we have a Braun vent hood that needs some work done on the lights. We're going to turn off the breakers that send power to the vent hood and we're going to pull out these old crusty light receptacles that are kind of burned and messed up. You can use a standard head screwdriver to help you start this prying out process. We just want to bring this out to about here so we can expose the wires. And I'm going to make sure again that we've got the breakers turned off. We'll do that on both of them. So we're going to kind of tug and twist and get these things out. Then we're going to go ahead and cut off uh, the wire that's going to the old receptacle. We got a new one here from Amazon. We're going to strip back about a quarter inch of the wire that was coming from the uh, vent hood out to the light. And then we're going to use some wire nuts. You can also use wire crimper, uh, wire um, joiners to hook the wires together. But uh, wire nuts are pretty quick and easy. So we're going to put the two insulated insulator or conductor parts, the part without the insulator, together and then we'll put the wire nut on and twist righty tighty to get nice and tight. So I'm just going to make sure I strip back that insulation about a quarter inch. Take the, two, the wire from the light and the wire from the vent hood, bring the power to it, 12 volts AC, and I'm going to put on the wire nut and twist righty tighty nice and tight. So these are halogens, so they have a um, 12 volts coming to them. Now if that still doesn't work, you may want to take some electrical cleaner and clean the switch. You can spray and then wiggle the switch back and forth to try to clean the contacts it may be the reason that the lights won't go on. The other issue could be the transformer which is taking the 110 volts and stepping it down to 12 volts to power the halogens may be defective and that lives up um, near the chimney part that's going up uh, to take the, the uh, air out to uh, the roof. So, worth a try though to clean the switch. If that still doesn't work, it's probably the transformer, which is a little bit more involved. You can get them between $60 to $120. We're going to put the switch back in by pushing it up and to the right. We're going to push up this left side until it clicks into position. There we go. And then testing out the light. And then we also have the fan. It sounds really good. Thanks so much for watching our video. We really appreciate your support. And when you get a chance, please press the subscribe button below so you can be subscribed. And also the notification bell so we can send you more videos about appliance repair. Please also give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. If you really like the video and it really helped you, please press this new applaud button and you can show your support and also get a nice clapping hands for your video. Thanks again.